This for Sagittarius versus um Leo. This for Sagittarius versus Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. So these just fell out of my hands just now. We got make the effort in different paths. We have the love is worth taking the risk that you are being called to move forward to. And then we have you and your person are not on the same page. It's time to have a conversation. Thank you, Tyra, for Virgo. So Virgo did skip the line, y'all. So we are doing extension for Virgo next. Once again, if I have not said just sign, it's because the donation was not sent then. Let's see what else is coming in right now. So for a lot of you, I don't know Sagittarius and Leo. Both of y'all fire signs. It's not looking good for y'all right now. We got letting go and unrequited feelings. So we have, if someone leaves you more confused than comforted, then you might need to reassess their assets to you. So this is setting some boundaries in the connection. And then we have, there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going in a healthy way. So I'm not saying that y'all not going to be together. I'm saying that the relationship is toxic. What else is coming in for this relationship right now? I appreciate y'all. So we got to leave your fears behind. It's because some of y'all are so worried about somebody cheating or somebody stepping out. They are stopping your relationship from blossoming. And then we have, this will create new friendships and attract new love in the relationship. Y'all both got to open yourselves to each other. I don't care if y'all started off as friends or lovers. Y'all have to get to that point. That's the thing for a lot of y'all. Thank y'all admins. I see y'all. Thank y'all so much. Let's see what else is coming in, y'all. My name is D-Reader the Mean Out here. Once again, for those of y'all that are new. And welcome to the Mean Out channel. Let's see what else is coming in. Oh, it's, um, it should be, uh, 0773. 0773. It should be that, baby. My bad. Let me can y'all can y'all type 0773 in the comments real quick. All right, what else is coming in for this relationship right now? So there's definitely some boundaries that's gonna have to be set. That's the thing. There are definitely some boundaries that's gonna have to be set in this relationship. That's gonna be the only way that this works. Thank y'all. Somebody wants free from this connection. Thank you, baby. So we will be doing an extension for Capricorn next, actually. Capricorn did skip the line again. So we'll be doing an extension for Capricorn next, y'all. Thank you. Okay, so this is the thing. You both need control in this relationship. There's some boundaries that need to be set. Gemini's coming up shortly, baby. Now unless you want to skip the Gemini to skip the line. Y'all need to teach each other how to love each other and be clear on what you will and won't allow. And if it's just not working, Sagittarius, and if it's just not working, Leo, then it's about time to free yourself. What's the final message? Accept the flaws and work with the flaws within yourself and acknowledge your own flaws. And guess what? It'll be so much easier to acknowledge each other's flaws. If y'all can make it through the challenge period, I am seeing there's some jealous energies outside of this connection that are affecting this relationship as well. Jealousies from others may serve as an obstacle in order for this connection to be successful. And then we got to express your love. So if y'all are wanting this relationship to be successful, if y'all are wanting this relationship to grow, then it's important for you to, you know, let each other know how you feel about each other. I appreciate every single one of y'all. Thank you.